Hey guys welcome back to another video today I am going to show you how to make a test your time game in Roblox studio. Let's aim for 10 likes on the video, and I would really appreciate it if you guys subscribed. I will do a voice reveal at 500 subs, if we get there anyway enjoy the video. Ok guys so first you just want to open the blank base plate then delete it, because we don't need it. You should just be left with nothing but the sky. Go into lighting, and set the time of day to anything you like, but I will make it midnight. Ok so now guys you want to go and make your OB. It can be, as long as you want, but try not to make it too long as it is a test your time game. I'm just going to get an abi I made for another game, and it is not that long so it works fine. Spend as much time on the abi as you like, there is no need to rush. Make sure you add a part at the start of the abi. Call it start part. Also make sure from collide is off for it, and make sure to add a platform in the spawn location. So now that you have made the abi, and put in the spawn location we need to add the timer. Insert a screen GUI into start a GUI and call it whatever you like. Then insert a text label into your screen GUI, and design it however you like. Make sure to set the text to 0.0. .0. The plugin that I use to make the GUI not look out of place on other devices is in the description. It is a very good plugin I recommend you use it, if you are a GUI designer. Now we have made the timer, we need to script it. Insert a remote event into replicated storage, and call it start timer. Now insert a script into your start part and just type what I type. All code used in every video in this series will be in the description. When it comes out, a model of the timer, start part and scripts will be in the description if you wish to use them. However, the AB is not going to be in the description. Try to make your own. After you have done that, insert a local script inside of your timer text label, and type the following. Once again source code will be in the description for you to use and learn from. So now that you have done everything, test it and it should work guys. If you have trouble with anything, let me know in the comment section and I will try and help you fix your issue. Consider liking and subscribing, and I will see you all in the next one.